Good afternoon. Louise is back with her frugal moments. I have something to share with you. It's just a sandwich. This is what you're going to need. You're going to need your French bread. You're going to need your cheese. You can provolone, Vermont, Vermont white cheddar cheese, nice and buttery, so gourmet. You'll love it. Your roast beef. That's what you're going to need, roast beef. If you can, if you can find the Italian beef, don't know what where you can find that. You can probably find it in your meat section. But I got delicatessen uh, roast beef, which is quicker. Yeah. Your beef broth, artisan beef broth. Why? Because it's full body flavor. Or you can use a can of your consomme or a can of au jus, which means with juice with sauce. Yeah. And then your jardinera. Now, the kind I normally buy when I'm in Chicago, where actually I'm getting this recipe from and I'm sharing it with my fans, is normally in a, um, olive oil, but I think olive oil is a little bit too heavy, so I want to deter from that. This one's in water and vinegar. So what you're going to do, you're going to toast your French bread or your Italian bread, whichever one you prefer, it's all to your liking, right? Toast it into the oven. Take your roast beef, right, with um, your beef broth or consomme or au jus. You put it in there and you ensure that it's nice and hot. Now, you don't want it too hot if you do it on the stove because actually the meat is already cooked. Okay? So, once you take it out of the oven, line your bread with the provolone cheese or your cheddar, um, Vermont cheddar cheese, whichever cheese you prefer, really. Then, once you to do that, then you want to layer it, take your beef, right, out of your pot. Don't forget, you have sauce in there, your au jus or your beef broth, right? You don't want to drain it so much, you know, um, you want it to be wet so it can, so it can sop the bread, yeah? So this is what you're going to do. Take it out, allow the drippings to go onto the bread and cheese because it's going to melt the cheese. Ooh, got it. And then you want to top it off with your Giardinera. You know what? I get tongue twisted every time I do that. I'm practicing, practicing, and I'm still getting tongue twisted. I don't understand. But anyway, it's all in fun. Now, you may want to take some of the au jus juice, right? Put it, or your broth, put it in your little in your little sauce bowl. Put it on your plate, put the sandwich, have your fries um, around it. You may want to add an apple, cut it up in slices, right? Because you, you need fruit. And guess what you're getting with this meal? Check it out with the bread. Okay, you have your starch. Cheese, you have your dairy. Meat, you have your protein. Are you with me, the food groups? How are you doing? Your jardinera, got it this time. <laughs> you have your vegetables in here. Guess what? You have your cauliflower, you have your olives, you have your um, carrots, you have your bell pepper, and, and, and vinegar. Oh, it's gonna be so good. Top with the with the beef broth. Oh, check it out, guys. I can just taste it. Enjoy. Have a great day. Listen, I'm gonna be sharing more frugal tips with you. Stay healthy, stay vibrant, stay encouraged, and eat healthy food. More to come. Enjoy your day. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.